Hmm. All right, YouTube. I wonder if this is going to be enough, though. I really do wonder, right? Because when I've done up here, I've done the cricket club, the tennis club, and the rugby club. But what I've gone and done here, I've put the comma in front of the gym, then the comma in front of the cricket club, before and. You never put a comma before the and. And then the tennis club, and then the rugby club. Because when you put in the and, it's a conjunction, so you never do that. You never put a comma in front of a conjunction, a joining up word. You never do that. So when you're doing the list, so it'll like be football pitch, comma, then you go to the gym, I don't know, football pitch, I put another comma at there, I'm not too sure, but then I went to the gym, I put, I put the, the gyms there, instead of putting went to the gym, I put the gyms there, then comma, after the gym, cricket club, comma, then you've got the and, so never put the comma in front of the and, then you got tennis club, but you put the I put the comma in the middle of there. Rugby club. Then you come to and again. You never put a comma in front of the and. So the in the rugby club, I'd put the comma in between the rugby club because I won't never put it in front of the and anyway. Never do that anyway. Never put a comma in front of the ands. Or the becauses, because they're joining up words. And you should get it better, folks. Anyway, let's see if we can do a spirit box and get Alan and T talking, yeah?